may be a draw for surfers, but lifeguards are warning that the water can be treacherous. We have team coverage of the high surf. Chris Wolf has the latest from Manhattan Beach. But first, we check in with KTLA meteorologist Vera Jimenez for a look at how long the dangerous conditions will last. Vera. Thank you so much. Well, the last of these adv advisories, pardon me, and warnings is due to expire on Saturday. So we are going to see multiple days of these conditions along the coast, and that really is going to be uh, the big story as we head into the weekend, even though we are expecting some rain as well. And part of this uh, uh, the event is actually because of a very strong system that we are seeing in the Pacific Northwest and along the northern Oregon coast there. So that is what's producing this long period swell that is bringing these amazing wave heights to Southern California. 7 to 12 feet for LA County. Some sets could hit as much as 15 to 20 along the Ventura County coast. The average wave height there will be somewhere between 10 and 15 and some sets there may also hit 20 and even Orange County, 6 to 12 feet. Extremely dangerous and life-threatening rib currents and also some flooding. The National Weather Service was also talking about the possibility of some damage, structural damage to like piers and also to uh, along the jetties there. So please be extra careful uh, if you do go out and look at the waves. Remember never to turn your back to the Pacific Ocean, especially when you um, are talking about wave that are this big. Uh, we'll take a look at the rest of the numbers and of course the rain that is heading our way in just a few minutes for now. Back to you guys. Thank you, Vera. The high surf is expected to draw large crowds to the beach, but whether you're in the water or just watching the waves, lifeguards are urging extreme caution. KTLA's Chris Wolf has the latest from Manhattan Beach. Some intense waves crashing along the coast in Manhattan Beach Wednesday night may be a sign of things to come, dangers to come as the new year fast approaches. The National Weather Service is warning several communities along the central and southern California coast about potentially destructive ocean activity. Experts say beach conditions will become extremely dangerous during the next few days with high surf, life-threatening rip currents, possibly damaging coastal flooding and significant beach erosion. Los Angeles, Ventura, and Santa Barbara counties are on alert. Waves 15 to 20 feet high could be hammering the shoreline starting Thursday. People are urged to stay out of the water because of an exceptional risk of ocean drowning. Is your family aware of this, this high surf advisory, huge waves expected tomorrow for the next few days? Yeah, we're all excited. How so? 15 to 18 feet is crazy. We haven't seen it in a year. Well, maybe not years, but like a really long time. And are you excited about watching this, but you're not going to get in the water, are you? I don't know. I was thinking about it. Maybe not. I think watching it is safer. If you go under the waves, 15 and 18 feet, you're going to be like ragdolled. It's crazy. Yeah. Thrown around, tossed around. Mm -hmm. Ragdolled, you call it? Oh, yep. Dangerous. I don't know. I haven't surfed in a while, but yeah, it's going to be pretty crazy out here. Yeah. Are you going to attempt to surf or just stay out of the water? I'll probably stay out, yeah. yeah. Meteorologists predict parts of Ventura County will get slammed. People we spoke with say they are drawn to the sand and surf to soak in the sights no matter what happens. Awesome, amazing nature, mother nature, and I just want to see it. I love the ocean. It's my middle name, I think. <laughs> and that was Chris Wolf reporting from Manhattan Beach. Meanwhile